What is going on to you Pisces out there? Hope y'all have a great day. Make sure to smash that like button so that you can get more connected into the energy right for this reading. So because when you smash the like button, you get more connected. Um, also, there's a link in the comment section below. Click on it. It will redirect you to a website which has all the ways to be able to financially support the channel. So I can most definitely keep the show going. Everything from uh, your birth chart readings, tarot readings, the books that I have that are on Amazon. If you want to learn how to read the tarot, I can teach you that too. Also, um, I just want to say thank you. So for you Pisces, you have the Six of uh, Swords, the Two of Cups, and you have the Star card. So the Six of Swords is about you, Pisces, um, moving forward in said life, like I said before. And the way that you're moving forward is the Two of Cups, dating new people. Um, a lot of you Pisces knew that being single obviously wasn't going to last forever. And remember how it is that I told you, Pisces, that within the past couple of weeks, I want to say within the past two months, two to three months, because we're actually in April now, uh, from the top of the year, you Pisces was, was really reconnecting with yourself, trying to reintroduce yourself to yourself again, and really just going back to the drawing board and healing parts of yourself that needed, that you knew needed to be healed. And now you Pisces are finally out here getting, you know, putting your best foot forward, trying to get to know people. The star card now, right? The star card and the queen of swords represent, however, people better step to you correctly though, because now that you Pisces, see, that's the thing. Now that you Pisces have healed parts of yourself that you know that need to be healed, now you have a whole new level of insight that you didn't have if you wouldn't have went in, in, on, an, in a, on an inner journey or a journey on the inside to find out who you were, who you are. So now you understand if someone is, if they are stupid enough to step to you with some kind of game, I'm not saying that you Pisces will be paranoid, but you'll know that you need to be mindful around this person. And then the thing is, is that the strength card is about how you, uh, because you're not going for it. You know, you're not going for the someone acting like they're perfect, right, at first. And then when they act like they are perfect at first, right, for you, then they switch up on you in a drop of a dime. You don't know what happened. Now all of a sudden they switch up. If they switch up metaphorically off with their head, and what I mean when I say off with their head, I'm talking about from the perspective of you Pisces are going to cut them off. You're going to cut them loose. They are not going to have any more access to you if that's how it is that they choose to carry themselves whenever they interact with you, right? Because then the high priestess and the three of wands now is about how since that's the case, a lot of you Pisces really have to understand as well that you're in a particular situation where what you've got going on, you don't wanna jeopardize that and you shouldn't. You Pisces finally have a level of internal peace that you've been striving to you already had it, but you've been tr you've been striving to get more in tune, more in touch with what that peace means for you in particular. And every time you Pisces, you know, like fish to water, were finally able to get a chance to get into those waters that you wanted to. It would always be somebody else or something intruding, being an intruder or an invader on that messing with you, messing with your own internal peace. So now the thing is that the high priestess and the uh, three of wands represents you Pisces know this. And the situation for you is you'll dip, but you also have secret admirers as well. That's what I mean when I say you'll leave, right? But you, at the same time, those people will often also give, give you your respect. You will get your respect when you're actually, when you actually leave these weirdo people alone. That's the ironic part. 
the the irony of it is you'll actually gain self you'll actually gain respect you have self respect but you'll gain respect from others particularly the ones that would that would be playing games with you when you leave them because now they know that you Pisces are not playing with them and you and you were playing with them it's their loss though that's the, that's the situation it's their loss and the thing about it is is that the three of wands rep the high priestess and the three of wands represents them admiring the fact that you're already on your way towards trying to meet somebody else because you Pisces don't have time for it it's off with their head if they wanted to if they want to play games because the four of wands is all about how it is that you you Pisces you know you know your home you know the people that you calling them close to you, they have to really be true blue. You know, they have to really have your back. And if they if they're not going to have your back, why be in your life? Why are these people in your life? And, I, and, I, and I'm starting to see you Pisces really start to look at it like that. But this is something that you Pisces should have always have looked at it as you Pisces should most definitely have looked at it from a perspective of that. Forget about all of that, you just busting your butt and doing everything for the sake of another person and they're not appreciating it. They never appreciate it, but you're the one that's giving them a commitment. If that's how it is that they're going to do, you, Pis you Pisces might as well be single again. At least you had a, a more peaceful time. So then the Two of Swords and the Page of Cups now. Is about how you Pisces are in a situation where, you know, what you've got going on is um, it's got a lot of people stuck because if they are to approach you from the delusion, from the, the delusional nonsense, right, on some two of sword stuff, again, page of cups. You have too much internal peace to allow somebody to mess that up because they wanted to play this mind game with you you're better off by yourself if that's the case but i'm seeing with this high priestess you do have secret admirers but the secret admirer ironically are the same people that you would end up having to leave behind because they ain't want to respect your time when you were there they they would know then that they missed out on a very good opportunity to be with you so let's clarify the high priestess. Let's clarify this high priestess. Get a better understanding if there's anyone else that, you know, is paying attention to you. Four of Pentacles, Four of Wands, the Hanged Man, the Judgment, and you have the Ten of Pentacles. The Four of Pentacles and the Four of Wands represent you're you're giving out Nathan. You're giving out nothing as far as you're as far as from the perspective of you Pisces are not wasting your time, your effort on someone. If you show this person effort, that's because you thought that they had value. You thought that they had they could have been a, a good match for you. Once you find out that they don't, you Pisces are out of there because it takes two. And you Pisces are, are understanding it more and more. Says the hanged man, you're being a lot more patient too. Pisces can be, you know, y'all can be a little bit of a, of a zodiac sign that can be too late or too soon. You know, the timing can be off because Pisces rules, Pisces and Capricorn actually rules over time, right? Uh, but at the same time though, right? Pisces actually rules over time manipulation. So it's like, you know, but the point that I'm trying to make here with that is you Pisces have a better understanding that, you know, it takes time. It's going to take time. You can't just get to know somebody so soon and act like you know the person for like 15 years and you've only known them for two months. The person has to show you that they're interested in you, right? They can't just tell you on some fling type stuff immediately. The two of y'all just hit it off. It's like a whirlwind. It's like, no, you Pisces are going to be way more patient. You're slowing down. The, high, the, the judgment 
the judgment and the ten of uh, pentacles, right, represents because you've been around the block more than a couple of times. You Pisces know good and too well how fast people can switch up from acting like they're so they're such a good they're such a good match for you. Next thing you know, they start switching up on you and you don't know what happened. You Pisces are standing there confused or lost or bewildered as to what happened. So, you know, if the person wants to show you some form of effort, then that's exactly what it is that they're going to do. No more the kid gloves for, for anyone. So that's pretty much it. Comment on the video, like the video, subscribe.